Hey everyone, it's Jamie here and there are 112 days left in 2019 and that means it's time to get hyper focused on one goal that you want to achieve so that you can make 2019 your best year yet. So tune in today. left in 2019 and you are not where you wanted to be. I hear this all the time. Here's the deal. There's still 112 days left and the world can change massively in 112 days and your world can change in 112 days if you get focused. So many times we set out at the beginning of the year with this ridiculously long list of goals that we want to achieve and here we are, summer's over, fall's kicking in, and we're like, shit, we're not where we wanted to be. I know I've been there, I know so many of my clients have been there, so what I want you to do is I want you to just deal with the disappointment of it. I'm just kidding, I don't want you to deal with the disappointment of it. I want you to pull out that list of goals that you made at the beginning of 2019, and I want you to just start crossing things off that are not in alignment with where you wanna to be today. Perhaps you've pivoted. Perhaps it took you way longer to achieve one of the things on that list than you expected it to. Perhaps some of the things that aren't there, you're like, why did I even write this down this year? I know that that's happened to me and it happens with all of my clients. So given the fact there's still 112 days left in 2019 and I want you to have the best year yet, here's what I want you to focus on to make this year a massive success. I want you to pick the one thing that fires you up. I want you to pick the one program or service that you have that you could day in, day out, get excited about and know that you can serve your ideal client at the highest level with only this program. All too often I see people try and bring forth way too many initiatives and then nothing ends up being a success. And oftentimes this is what happens at this time of year when people are like, I'm just not where I wanted to be. I feel disappointed. I feel sad. I feel like I'm not accomplished, that I'm not a good entrepreneur. If you are having any of that head trash, what I want you to do is I want you to grab a sheet of paper, I want you to just write it all down, and I want you to just say this to yourself. I love you, I'm sorry, thank you, I forgive you. And I want you to take that sheet of paper, I want you to crumple it up, and I want you to throw it out. And I want you to then get your list out of things that you wanted to accomplish and pick just one thing. No matter what it is, perhaps it's a course, perhaps it's a book, perhaps it's a service, but just pick one single thing. And I always love picking revenue generating things, especially at this time of year, because for me, it's like, I want to crush that revenue goal that we set out at the end of the year. And so for me, I always focus on that. September in the fourth quarter of the year is like, let me just focus on how I can support as many people as I possibly can and helping them achieving their own goals. And so for you, pick that one service, that one product that lights you up and stay solely focused on that. Figure out and get creative. Use your creative juices. Instead of creating new products, use your creative juices to stay focused and to market yourself. Get yourself on other podcasts. Start a YouTube channel. Figure out creative ways to market yourself. Start doing Instagram stories. Start doing Pinterest. And make everything in pursuit of that one product or service. And I guarantee you, if you do this and you show up day in and day out and you leverage your email list and you leverage social media and you really, really focus on just that one thing, your entire world will change in the next 112 days. Seriously, I guarantee it. So stay focused, cross out all those other things that are not in alignment, forgive yourself for not being where you wanna be and move on from it, but then just do the work and get consistent because things can radically change in 112 days. And so I wanna hear all about how your world has radically changed in the next 112 days. But I also want you to share with me below the one thing that you're gonna focus on to make 2019 your best year yet. At the end of the day, it's up to you to get hyper-focused on one thing to make your 2019 the best year yet. So drop in the comments below and let me know what's the one thing you're gonna focus on to make this year your most successful year yet.